watch this? Poo! It's erupting! Just like a magma! Oh, I'm thirsty. I froze some water just for a time like this. Huh? Why didn't the water freeze at all? <gasps> oh dear. Oh, it froze up just like that. I'm sure it was just water a second ago. <gasps> I must have become Elsa! <laughs> what do you mean, Dani? It's because of super cooling. Mm -hmm. Super cooling? What's super cooling? You know that water freezes at zero degrees, right? But when pure water gradually gets colder without any stimulus, it remains in its liquid state, even at below this freezing point. This is called super cool state. Give it a shock, boom! It goes, oh, that shocked me, freeze! Wow, that's so amazing! I want to create super cooling again! Friends, would you like to try this super cooling experiment with me? Let's try it! First, the water has to get colder very slowly. Hmm. We need to let it freeze for about an hour. I'll mark the time, set it to one hour. Hmm. How long does it need to freeze to get super cooling? I wonder. Friends, you can do the super cooling experiment with Coke. But for Coke, you do it a little differently. First, you have to shake it really hard like this. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake. Then, put it in the freezer and measure the time. <laughs> Time's almost up. Okay, now we'll take out the water and Coke frozen for one hour. Here. I brought the water and coke frozen for an hour. When you bring frozen water and coke, you have to be very careful and gentle. It's in its super cool state, so if it gets shocked, it could transform. Now, I'll give it a shock. hi -yah! Oh. Oh. Oh, it doesn't seem to be super cooled. These ice particles cracked a little bit. But it's not the super cooling I thought would happen. Maybe one hour isn't enough. Oh yeah, let's try the Coke then. It's a little different with the Coke. First, you let the carbon out a little. Then close it tightly and shake it really hard. Failed. <laughs> Friends, I think one hour was not quite enough time. How about we wait for the next frozen water and coke for their super cool state? I'll give it a shock! Hiya! <laughs> no, no, not yet. Hiya! Oh no! Oh, how can this be? Oh, oh, what went wrong? It's a failure. I need to figure out why. Why didn't it work? <gasps> Here it is! Super cool state must be reached by freezing the water very slowly. Oh, then, did it freeze too quickly because the freezer temperature is too low? Or maybe it's because I opened the freezer door too often. Hmm. We'll try to experiment in a different way. First, adjust the freezer temperature to 16 degrees Celsius. Second, we'll open the freezer door just once when we take out the frozen water out. And third, we'll freeze the water for one hour and 30 minutes. Well, I hope we succeed this time. <laughs> so, we'll freeze five bottles of pure water again. Now, I've taken out the five bottles of water. And we'll see if they work this time. Please transform. Super freeze. Yeah. Oh, oh, wow. Oh. Wow. Oh, incredible. Friends, did you see that? It froze in a flash. Oh my, dear me. I really <laughs> must be Elsa. Wow, I'll try opening it. 
Da 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 da! Pour off this suddenly frozen water. Oh wow, this is so awesome! And we're left with half water and half ice. We finally did it! When you freeze water slowly at negative 16 degrees, boom! And then give it a shock, you'll get super cooling! Try it out at home, friends! I secretly froze 2 liters of water and 1.5 liters of coke beforehand. Do you think we'll succeed in super cooling this time too? Oh, it's really heavy. <laughs> Here we go! <laughs> oh, wow, it worked! Success! Whoa, friends, can you see it? It turned into ice like this. Whoa. I think you'll see it better with the coke because it's black. For coke, remember you need to let out the carbon gas first. Let out the carbon a little. And close it back. Watch carefully. Shake it. Ta-da-da-da! <laughs> mm, let's check if it really turned into slush. Or we'll pour it into a cup. Oh. Oh, oh! It's erupting! <laughs> it's erupted! <laughs> wow, but it really froze solid! Let's celebrate and have a drink! <laughs> hey friends, I'll give you an OX quiz. There are mosquitoes. Buzz Buzz living in our country, right? But do mosquitoes live in the North Pole? The answer is... One, two, three... Oh! Mosquitoes even live in the North Pole! Even flies and butterflies live there too! But they say it's because of global warming! It's not just something interesting happening! Let's all protect the North Pole! <laughs> <laughs> 